I spend most of my time when I'm out here in the field. I'll show you everything from left to right. Uh, back here, just getting the name of the name of the track. This is where I sleep at right here. I uh, usually put my head right about there behind the seat. Uh, this is all stuff for heat that obviously does not work because you know uh, this is more heat stuff that don't work. Um, these are my night vision goggles. I keep them right here so they, I can just pull them out while I'm driving. They just did this better. Uh, this is the automatic fire extinguisher system. Hopefully, never have to use that. Um, this right here, this is um, all of the calm stuff. Um, this is the one that I mess with most of the time. This controls the volume on my, my helmet so I can talk to my um, ATC that's up top. And, you know, all that stuff. I can keep moving over this way. Right here, my um, engine transmission oil tip gauges. Need them work. Uh, engine on transmission oil pressure, they both work. The fuel and the battery. With the fuel right now, I've got it up on the upper tank. There's a switch right here. Flip that, goes to lower tank, so upper, lower. And we keep it on upper tank. The uh, lower tank is supposed to always stay full. And so when you're measuring how much fuel you have, you consider that's 50% if it's full. And say it's half right now, so we have about 25%, so about 75% fuel. And here's the battery. Oh, right now it's about mid yellow. It's supposed to be between high yellow and low green. Um, the master warning light lets you know it's on. Uh, here's the master power itself. We have to keep this on so we don't lose fuel on the radios and so that we keep the radios on. When it's off, you know, everything is off. And then go down, speedometer, well, not speedometer, to the RPM gauge and the speedometer. I'm sorry. I got that backwards, yeah. No, RPM speedometer. And keep moving over here to all these. Yeah. Every time you start it up, you hold these right here for about 5 to 15 seconds. And then you press this. This starts the whole whole thing. And this light lets me know the parking brake is on. Um, right here is the lights. You flip this up. Right now, the lights are off. Go right, have the lights on, turn left for blackout lights. And that's the lights you use um, at nighttime when you're. Well, you don't really use them, it's, so you can help you see with your night vision goggles and all the way to the right is headlights. Over here is my fan. Don't work, obviously. Why would it? Um, steering wheel. Uh, now here you got the parking brake. It's in park right now because we're not moving. Got the brake and the throttle. And right here we have the gear shifter. Right now it's neutral, which is park. You know, it's pretty simple reverse and. First gear up here, it's uh, really slow. You use that for making sharp turns. You do uh, the same thing for second gear, third and fourth gear, mainly for uh, going on long trips down a road where you're not turning as much and you know, it goes faster. You can make the same gun about, it says 40. Well, I, you can probably get up to 50, 60. And uh, right here, it's um, raising my seat up right now. It's lower because, you know, no reason to be out on top of the hatch. Hatch is closed, are open right now. So then sunlight and air in. This right here shuts it off when it's running. You just pull this fuel, it's coming in and it turns off. Down here, um, this is not supposed to be open, but I've got it open right now just because there's heat coming off the engine, which is kind of warming me up a little bit. Here's the periscopes. Um, if you need to, in case there's like, uh, you know, chemicals in the air, or you're taking on direct fire, small arms fire, you keep these closed, they're bulletproof. And you can drive looking out these. Um, we're gonna do that sometime during this field problem. And the periscopes look out into uh, everything around you. And this right here, this right here is, uh, you can put a slave cable up to it, which is basically a jumper cable like you'd have in a car and it would power another vehicle. And uh, right here is my helmet. Got number 19 stickers on it. This is my uh, mouthpiece so I can talk to the ATC up top and I got a earpiece so I can hear them and I got a mount up there for my night vision goggles. And back there is just a converter we have hooked up to the battery that's charging uh, our phones and stuff like that right now since so we're not really doing anything.